Hey, what's up everybody? So what you reading on the screen is 100% true. And I'm here to talk about this BS. So before we get into the video, I just want to say, if you're new to the channel, thanks for giving me a chance. If you like the video and you like the content, make sure you click the subscribe button at the end. I got all the content from basketball and football. This is a channel need to be at, so make sure you click the subscribe button. Now let's actually get into the video. So I was taking up for Antonio Brown at first, but this man is really a female. He really said if he doesn't wear his old helmet that he's worn his whole career, he's going to just quit. Bro, you 30 years old. Here's a look at the helmet that he had a two hour conference call over about saying he need to still be able to wear. This standard ass helmet. This helmet is old as shit. I wore this helmet when I was 13. I wore this helmet in high school. All of my friends wore this helmet. Shit, you probably wore this helmet. If you ain't old, you feel me? This helmet is old. The league don't got nothing against this helmet. They just trying to protect people's brand because they know what's up. Switch off, man. He talking about he don't want to wear the new helmet because he can't see out of it. It's messing up his catching ability. Well, if you really the truth, you'll go out there and adjust to one of these other options they are giving you. It's not like they saying, oh, you can only wear these three helmets. They giving this man multiple helmet options, bro. You mean tell me you can't see out of all of them? Man, making me mad, man. This dudes out here that wear a standard bar. Everybody that plays football, especially the linemen, y'all know what a bar is. I know there's people out there that will wear that helmet because they want to play pro football so bad. My man's Damon Giuseppe from the Browns. Y'all know him if y'all ain't know him. Y'all need to go figure out the story. I got it coming out soon, though, but my mans will wear a bar. You're 30 years old. You're crying about a helmet. Come on, man. Change is inevitable. And then he goes on Instagram, and he uses a paid and full caption. He says, I love the game. I love the hustle. Young and got dope. He can lead the league. But if I leave, will the fans still going to love me, man? Hell no. You up here crying about a helmet. If you really that pressed about this helmet, quit. I don't want to see you play football no more because you're really taking taking this opportunity for granted. You feel me? This is really making me mad, bro. And I honestly don't think he go fit in Oakland. If Derek Carr couldn't sling Amari Cooper the ball, what makes you think he'll be able to sling Antonio Brown the ball? Antonio Brown go be crying, bro, because he not going to know how to get used, bro. You feel me? So that's all I got to say, man. That's debatable, but that's just how I feel, man. So fuck this nigga Antonio Brown, man. I'm sorry I'm using this language because my friend told me to chill out, but fuck that, man. Fuck Antonio Brown. If you really want to act like this, quit. Quit, man, for real. And let me also throw in there, this man has a major frostbite on his foot from being in an ice tub, bro. So not only is his team missing them reps, but he's also threatening to quit or sit out at least a decent amount of time over this old helmet. This man making me mad, man, because he's ungrateful. He think he all this and that. Man, fuck you and your fucking gold mustache, nigga. Fuck you, nigga. That's all I got to say, man. Let me know what y'all think in the comment section, man. You fucking, man. I, I, what am I saying, man? Like, comment, subscribe. I got more content coming soon.